What's going on, you guys? This be your boy, Scotty by Nature TV, and we're here for a brand new episode of Yes for the Mess, where we talk about celebrity gossip, hot topics, and all things reality TV based. What's going on, you guys? I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful hump day, and I plan on doing the same, okay? I'm filming a couple of videos before I go to work because this is a late day, and I'm not going to have time to film anything later on. So, yes, I am giving you guys some videos, you know, to feed you guys for the rest of the day. Um... So um, right about now, um, you're going to get three videos today, like including this one. You're going to get two more after this one. But um, so, yes, be sure to be on the lookout for that. And um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get down with the get down. Now, um, for today's message, you guys already know I've been covering every single morsel of the escape drama. Yes, indeed. Ever since the show been on, I've been, you know, covering it. Shout out to myself, Jamie, that's me, and Make It Make Sense. We have really been on our grind covering all of this drama that's been going on with Escape. And you know, I had to give y'all another Escape video today. Now, Tamika Scott was recently on Watch What Happens Live. I think it was on Monday night, and she was on there with Alexa from the Real Housewives of Miami. I wish she had somebody else to be on that with because I do not like Alexia. However, she was on there and during a game called, I think it was called Can I Defend Her, where she was talking about defending her sister's behavior. She revealed that the gospel deal with Motown Gospel was a deal that Latasha and her was supposed to have, which Latasha said early on in the interview. But Tamika says she stole the deal from her. Let's get into what Tamika said during the game, and then we're going to come back and get our opinions, and we're going to be out of here. So let's listen in on this game that Tamika Scott played on Watch, What's Hap on Watch What Happens Live. Let's get into it, y'all. Last night, on SWB and Escape, Tamika almost cried her eyebrows off when she finally hugged it out with her sister, but when her eyebrows are safely attacked, we want to know what raises them in a round of... Can you defend her? Tamika, for each of Latasha's actions, tell us whether you can defend her or not, and why can you defend Tasha feeling body shamed by your text stating, if you had an ass to kiss? I can't defend her on that because that didn't mean that. It was a figure of speech. Okay. Uh, can you defend? It sounds like you were taking a crack in her ass. No, I okay. wasn't. Okay, all right. I, it, was, um, it wasn't. It's a figure of speech. Like, so if someone said, child bye, that don't mean, you know, okay. child bye. It's just a figure of speech. Okay. I would never, ever body shame anybody. Okay. But child bye, yes. That means bye, right? Bye. Like bye, like child bye. Like bye, good bye. bye. You're right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that one, yes. um, can you defend Tasha hiring her own stylist because she didn't like the group's look? No, I cannot defend that because she came out looking like a majorette. Uh, <laughs> can you defend Tasha not being your mother's favorite? <sighs> She's definitely the favorite, so I can't defend her on that either. Can you defend uh, her staying with Rocky for so many years? Uh, can you defend Tasha's suspicion that Candy might have had something to do with her solo project being shelved back in the day? No. Uh, can you defend Tasha meeting with Motown Gospel about a solo contract behind the girls' Talking about the back? contract that was meant for both of us that she stole from us. She stole from me. That was our that was our deal, and she took it. Okay. But you know, I guess you can't defend that then. No. Okay. Uh So as you can see, Tamika says that the deal that Latasha has right now on the table with Motown Gospel was a deal that was supposed to that was meant for her and Latasha to do a gospel project um, as a duo. So um, it's kind of like Latasha is looking bad in these streets. Every time we turn around, we hear about her, you know, doing some fraudulent BS. And then, you know, every time she's accused of it, she always, you know, sits around and deflects or she says that it never happened. Oh, I didn't steal this. I don't know nothing about this. I don't know nothing about that. I don't know nothing about this. So it's kind of like, you know, what's really going on? Like, is, is like, is everything that Tamika's saying, is that really a lie? Or is it the truth? Because, you know, you, your name is, every time the word thief comes up, your face pops up. So it's kind of like, what's really going on with this situation? Like, did you really steal that deal? Because it's kind of like, I know you said that at the beginning of the year, there was a deal on the table for you and your sister to do a gospel album. Um, that's something that your grandmother wanted you guys to do. And then, you know, you and her started having a bunch of issues and you decided 
however, that I, if I'm going to do this, I got to have peace while I'm doing it. So I, I can't do it with my sister. I'm going to take the deal for myself and I'm going to do it alone. I'm not going to do it with her. So did you and Tamika have that conversation or did you decide that I'm not going to do it with her? If the deal was for the both of you guys and if that and if that deal was meant for both of you guys to do a gospel album together on your own, why not have that conversation with Tamika? Because she was supposed to be a part of the deal. Why take the deal for yourself? Because you don't feel like, oh, I need to do this by myself. Oh, I need to do this by myself. Oh, I need to do this by myself. There should have been a conversation between you and your sister about this situation. But instead, in typical, you know, Latasha fashion, she got to do stuff by herself. So it's kind of like Latasha is just not meant to be in no group situation to me. You feel what I'm saying? I feel like her being in a group is just not it. I think that with, with Latasha, she has to be by herself because that's what she wants to be. She wants to be solo. She want to be by herself. She want to do everything by herself. And it's quite unfortunate that that's the way it's got to be, but it is. And I just feel like these two sisters are never going to be in a, in a genuine place. I don't think they're ever going to be good. I don't think they ever going to be, because I feel like at some point they may be able to forgive one another and move on, but the relationship would never be the same. It's, it's not going to be any trust in the situation. And as long as Latasha is frolicking around with her husband and we know she ain't going to let him go and she ain't going to leave him. You know, it's going to always be a problem. You know, I can only imagine, you know, being um, having a sibling with a husband or a spouse that I don't like. Because I remember when my sister had a boyfriend that I absolutely hated with a passion. And, um, you know, I personally felt like that created a wedge between me and her at the time. Now, me and my sister are good now. But at that time, you know her so-called boyfriend was always creating issues and always saying stuff that he had no business saying and always, you know, bringing up lies and bringing them to my sister and creating strife between me and her. So, you know, it made me be mad with her because she was with him. So a lot of the times these boyfriends, these girlfriends, these spouses, they can create a lot of family tension. So long as Latasha is still with Rocky, the relationship with Tamika would never be the same. And as long as, you know, Rocky is involved in the business in some kind of way, Escape and Latasha will never be able to work with each other. And that's just what it is. And it's very unfortunate. So um, what do you guys think about that? Do you guys think that Tamika is telling the truth about Latasha still in the deal? Do you think, and do you think Latasha stole the deal? Or do you think that this is just Tamika being dramatic? All right. So with that being said, you guys, this be your boy, Scotty by Nature TV. Be sure to like, rate, comment, subscribe, and share this video. And also click on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever a video drops. If you want to follow me on any form of social media, my Twitter, my Instagram, and my TikTok will be down below in the description box. With that being said, um, this be your boy, Scotty, and I am up out of here until my next video. I will talk to you guys a little bit later. Until then, bye, y'all.